bringing you a Instagram model famous-ish, I don't know how to explain this kind of tutorial. It was inspired by a selfie that I posted on, what day is it? Tuesday now, you guys are watching this on Friday, but I posted a selfie on Tuesday and you guys love the look. I have started wearing my hair down the middle when it's curled and I actually really, really like it. And I kind of just randomly did this look one day and I really like how it turned out. I think it looks amazing. It's all matte except for the highlight. So it's really, really flattering and you guys are seriously going to love it. It's kind of like Kylie Jenner inspired, but also just a lot of like Instagram famous kind of people have got the really like glowy and accentuated look that is really pretty and I think super flattering on pretty much everyone. So that's it this video if you guys are excited for this little get ready with me slash makeup tutorial. If you're new here, hi, I'm Cicely. You should go ahead and click that subscribe button so you won't miss out on any of my videos. But without further ado, let's just get started. Okay guys, so the very first step to this makeup look is to prime your face. I'm using the Moustave Lustrous Cream Base. It's a really, really nice base that's very smooth and really makes your face bright and glowy under your foundation, which is key. So next I am using the CoverGirl At Last Stay Fabulous Foundation in the color 832 Nude Beige, and I'm just buffing that in with a Real Techniques base brush. I love this brush, you guys. It's seriously amazing, and this foundation is amazing. Next I am taking the Laneige Cushion Concealer, and this is just a concealer that you can buy at Target, and I am just highlighting under my eyes and on the high points of my face, and then just kind of concealing any blemishes that I may have. Next, I am setting my face with the NYX Mineral Powder. I have the light medium shade, I believe, and I'm just dusting that all over my skin. Now I am taking the Benefit Hula Bronzer, and I'm going to be contouring my face with that using a Sigma brush. I'm just using an angled brush and kind of um, doing the 3E motion and then under my jawbone and of course on my nose. Now I am taking this blush. This is a MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural in the shade Light Ear, but Soft and Gentle is very similar. Now I am taking the Jouer Highlighter and I am just highlighting the high points of my face. So right above my cupid's bow, my cheekbones, and of course on my nose. So now I am going in with some MAC Matte Eyeshadow, and this is in the shade Showstopper, and I am just filling in my eyebrows. You guys have seen this before. I have an eyebrow tutorial that I will, I will link down below that's a little bit more in detail on how I fill in my eyebrows. But yes, I am just filling them in and getting them all shaped and to match my hair, because they really are not very full, and so I just love filling in my eyebrows. to the eyes, I am taking the Mica Beauty Cream Base and I am just applying that to my eyelids. It's very similar to Max Painterly or Soft Ochre, so if you guys have any of those or just any nude base that would work perfectly fine. And then moving on to the actual eyeshadow, I use two palettes. Um, I'm using the Lorac Pro Palette and the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. Wow, I am stumbling all over my words today. But yes, I just put a matte cream shade all over my eyelids and up to my brow bone. Now I'm taking a medium matte brown again and applying that into my crease and blending that out. Then I am taking a really dark chocolatey brown and I'm putting that on the outer corner and kind of blending that in. And then after that, I'm just taking a fluffy brush and blending that all together and really blending it out and making sure that there is a nice gradient effect and then once it's all blended I am going back in with that cream shade from the beginning it's a very just matte cream basic shade and I am fixing my eyelid and just kind of making it a little bit brighter and blending that in and then I am also highlighting the inner corner and right above my brow bone Next, I am just taking the NYC Liquid Liner in black and just applying a nice winged liner. This is optional, but I love winged liner and I think it's essential for getting Kylie Jenner or the Instagram famous kind of look. And then I am taking the Smashbox X-Rated Mascara and just applying that to my upper and lower lashes. And I also curled them beforehand. But now moving on to the best part, the lips. And this kind of just brings it all together. This is the Maybelline Matte Lipstick in 650 Nude Embrace. It's such a pretty color and I think it's definitely a dupe for the Kylie Jenner lip kit colors. I think it's amazing. And this is the finished look, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Look, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Again, if you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you won't miss any of my new videos. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.